This is a video by Richpin. Today we're working on a 1931 Model A Ford. And what are we doing today, Dad? We're replacing the bushings in the choke rod. Okay. Yep. Now we're going to remove this, slide it out. That holds the choke rod. And you. Now, what is worn? What's the part that's this, worn? This bushing here is worn out. I'll get it in a minute. Uh -huh. Now, do you need that clothespin to hold that choke rod up? No, I got to take it right out. Okay. Now, these are the pieces I had to take out there, uh -huh. and one's missing. Now, take the chucker, choke rod out. Okay. And this is the choke rod. Now, that's the choke rod. Take it inside to get it out. This is the bushing. All right, wait a Put it right here so they can see it. Okay. Being replaced with this bushing. Uh -huh. And this bushing is worn oval. And you replace it with this new one. Uh -huh. And this washer and the metal cup. Okay. So, I gotta put this one inside. So we don't have to take anything apart in the carburetor. Jackson, no, you just yeah. take that. Everything is on the uh, everything is on the choke rod here. Now, why did you have? What was the symptom of the truck? My choke rod was. It was it was backing off. Kept turning. Kept turning. And it would. Uh, so the so it had. Open up the, the so choke it had. Would, so it had no resistance on the choke rod, you say? No, it, uh, and it's supposed to have some. Right. So it was basically just floating around. And you couldn't keep your adjustment of the choke. Right. Okay, I understand. So this is the bracket right here we're looking at where that bushing goes into. So you put some brake fluid on that, on that little bushing there. So slide in. Yep. Okay. And that's all it takes to put it in. Oh, look at that. Now I gotta wipe my fingers off so I can get the rod. And we'll feed this down through. Okay. That's a tight fit, huh? That's what you want. Now you gotta find the hole. There it is right there. That one right there. As I go along, it would vibrate. Sure. It'd give me a hassle. Now I gotta go back on the other side. Okay. And put it together. All right, so we got the uh, choke rod all in. So yeah. now, now what do we have to do? We gotta put this rubber bushing Wait in. Wait a minute, I can't see it. You... On here. Okay, that one right there. And this leather washer goes in like this. Then you take this metal washer and put this in. I'm not sure whether it goes that way. Then the spring goes against them. Oh, I see. All those uh, pieces are right against the uh, firewall up there. Yeah. Well, that's real tight with those bushings in there, huh? That's what I want. And that's all there is to putting it back together. Wow. But it, it's tight, and it's not going to turn. So try, try it now. Turn the, uh, turn the choke rod. It should be totally different. Oh, yeah. A lot more resistance on the... A lot more resistance. <laughs> The choke will hold up a little bit. Wow. 
And that's all there is to installing your choke rod grommet set on your Model A Ford.